What is going on guys? Grave here. Of course, tomorrow we will be getting a new survival mode added into Red Dead Online. This, of course, is going to be Call to Arms. They did announce this last week. We still don't have a ton of details about this. The mode seems to be 10 ways of enemies while you're defending kind of a certain spot or property. And I think they definitely can build off this idea. I was hoping it was going to be more than 10 waves. I was hoping they would kind of go with the idea like they had in Undead Nightmare where you're fighting the waves of zombies and kind of a co-op thing. Where it was either, you know, you kill or be killed, you know, you just, the, the round lasted as long as you could stay alive. Um, so the 10, just 10 waves kind of makes it sound like more of a, a mission style thing in game. They said, of course, we're going to receive a telegram kind of letting us know exactly what to do and where to go and kind of how to start this. No word on how big this update's going to be. You know, they haven't talked about that yet either. But I'm really curious if this is going to be a co-op experience or if it's going to be more of a solo experience. Um, I would assume if it's 10 waves and there's not a difficulty kind of, you know, a, a, a way to change the difficulty, it's probably going to be just a solo thing. But if it's something kind of like uh, the bounties where you can go in and actually the more you do it, the harder it gets or you actually can just change the difficulty from the start, that might, you know, kind of lean toward the idea of being able to do it with friends or being able to match make it and just do it in co-op. I think, like I said, they definitely can build off this idea. If you look at what they did, like I said, with Undead Nightmare, they're adding in survival modes back in Red Dead Online. I think they can definitely build off, build off this and do different types of survival modes, different types of modes within the survival idea. I'm kind of curious what you guys think. Are you excited about this being added in? I know it's something that's a little bit different compared to what we're used to seeing in Red Dead Online. You know, you're used to seeing just new things being added in, whether it be something to do with your roles or something to do with new missions, kind of like what we have here with the Blood Money update. And I think this is going to be a little bit of a, a breath of fresh air when it comes to what some players would like to see in Red Dead Online. Because some people don't like to just have to go in and do story missions and, you know, stranger missions and these blood money uh, missions over and over. Some people would like to have something else to do besides just grinding out the same missions, uh, you know, every day. So I'm kind of curious what you guys think about the survival mode. Do you think it'll be something they will build upon, you know, something that Rockstar will continue to, you know, kind of evolve as the game goes on, or is this going to be one of those kind of one and done things that they add in and it's really not touched much after that? I'm hoping that's not the case. It may be sadly, but I think a survival mode would be a lot of fun. I think, like I said, it's going to be a breath of fresh air compared to some of the other content we've had. If you're not a big fan of just doing uh, story stuff over and over again. Anyway, guys, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. If you are a subscriber, make sure you have notifications turned on so you know when everything goes live here on the channel. And check out everything down in the description. The community, Discord, my Twitter, and of course, the affiliate here on the channel, Empire Jerky. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.